You need to follow these settings on your PC in order to get better performance and better FPS in your every single game on your any low-end PC or laptop. So guys, welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, please subscribe. This will take just one second from your life. So please make sure to subscribe, turn on the bell notification and with wasting any time, let's dive straight into our this video. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to refresh our Windows file. So for that, press Windows R together from your keyboard and this will open up this run dialog. Now simply type here prefetch, after that hit OK. This will open up this directory and make sure to delete all the temporary file out of this folder. Now again close out this file explorer. Now again press Windows R together from your keyboard and this time type here temp and press enter. Now press Ctrl A from your keyboard and select all these temporary file. Now hit delete, click continue and delete all this junk data from your PC. Now click cancel and leave this file. Now in the next step we are going to clean our windows shadow caches. So for that you need to go for your windows search, search for clean and you will find out this disk cleanup option. Go inside it, now click here on your C drive. Now hit ok. Now you need to find out here direct text shadow caches. Simply guys check mark on this box and uncheck all the other remaining boxes. After that click on the ok button hit delete file and delete direct text shadow cache out of your pc so guys now the next step you need to download is uf partition manager on your pc link available down in the description this is one of the best tools for optimizing your disk and this will help us to fixing the bad sector on our hard disk so guys you need to find out here your hard disk so i have 2 tb of the hard drive installed on my pc that is my local disk d and local disk c if you are using the hard drive for storing your game so guys you need to follow this step so guys simply select out here your disk drive after that go for show more option and there you will find out this option that is surface test so click on this option and guys this will start scanning your all the disk and find out all the bad sector on your hard drive and it will stop your pc from using that bad sector area of your hard drive that will make your pc more faster and also fix the fps drops and stutters while you're playing games on your pc so guys this will take 10 to 15 minutes to completing this task on your pc after that now you need to go for this toolkit section and there you will find out here this option that is the boot repair one click solution to fix various windows startup problem and provide uefi and pcd menu management so click here on this option now select out here your windows or whatever you're using windows 10 or 11 and after that click on the repair button if it is not visible for your pc so guys you can check it out here the current system does not need to be repaired mean everything is working fine and guys you can also use this application for various program like you want to clone the disk you want to convert the disk you want to recover the deleted data from your pc you can do everything in this single program and you can download this tool from the description of my this video so guys now in the next step we are going to optimize our windows power plan for gaming so for that go for your windows search search for power and you will find out here choose a power plan so guys open up your control panel inside you will find out here multiple options for selecting a best gaming power plan by default you will find out here balanced plan and high performance power plan and power saving plan and guys i have installed here with some high performance power plan and this is one of the best power plan if you want to improve your gaming performance how you can get this power plan on your PC. For that guys, you need to download power control on your PC and you can find out the link of my official website in the link in the description and from there you can download power control on your PC. Once you download power control, in the very first step for installing this Britsome high performance power plan on your PC, you need to click on the install button and this will install this power plan on your PC. After that, click on the drop down and select out here Britsome highest performance and click on the make activate for applying this power plan on your windows. Now here is settings for PC and here is settings for laptop users. If you have a PC so go with a parking set it on off, frequency scaling turn it off and set it on 100%. After that go for heterogeneous policy set it on hetero parking, short thread set it on prefer performance process and long thread on prefer performance process. Once you do the settings, now you need to go for Bridgestone dynamic boost enable, check mark on this box, show power plan settings notification, check mark on this box. After that, hit apply and click OK and that's it. Now you will find out here this power plan. Select it here from the power plan settings. Go for change plan settings. Set the settings on never. Now go for advanced power settings. And from here you need to follow hard disk. Turn off hard disk after 0 minutes. Now scroll down and go for processor power management. Click on the drop down there you will find out minimum processor state and maximum processor state. So go for maximum processor state and set it on 100%. After that, hit apply 
click ok and close out your power settings now in the final and the last step we are going to optimize our system configuration settings so for that open up your windows search and search for ms config or find out system configuration now open up this window inside you will find out startup selection simply go with selective startup load system service and load startup items after that now go for the boot menu open up advanced option check mark on this box click on the drop down and select out here highest number available on your pc now go for maximum process memory and make sure to uncheck this box from here now hit ok hit apply click ok and that's it now you need to simply one time reach your pc there have all the changes take effect after that launch your favorite game and enjoy the best performance out of your pc i hope so you love it please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and let the next video peace out